Welcome back, everyone. Working on the fuel lines. Um, you know, again, trying to get the rest of the fuel lines cut and bent and flared and installed and all that good stuff. Um, they get considerably longer in this section. Uh, there's one fuel line that's uh, right around 85 inches, so uh, pretty much goes uh, the entire length of the fuselage. Um, you'll see me do that in a little bit, but and then some uh, some other fuel lines that are much smaller, but you don't install those yet due to not having the the fuel pumps and the fuel filter that gets installed uh, behind the baggage compartment. You don't get that until, I don't know if it's the finish kit or the engine kit. The plan says the engine kit, but um, it would be kind of hard to install those after you've already joined the fuselage and the tail cone. So I'm not sure when that'll come in exactly, but uh, here's that big fuel line I was telling you about. And you have to slide that thing in all the way from the back of the plane and all the way up through the uh, center, the, uh, the wing spar bulkheads and... Um, up to the front, uh, right underneath where your, uh, where, the, where pretty much where the rotor pedals will be. Um, here working on some of the smaller ones, and that fuel line coil has gotten significantly smaller. Good thing though, I uh, didn't have to order any more fuel line. Actually, learned from my mistake from the very first one, and I was able to salvage um, that fuel line and make some of the smaller ones out of that. So didn't have to uh, order a new fuel line. Thank goodness. Got the new flaring tool in. You'll see me talk to that in a little bit. We are done for now with the fuel lines. Um, uh, yeah, turned out pretty good. I thought I had to ex order an extra tool, so I have a flaring tool. Um, you saw in the last video, I didn't know what I was going to do about flaring the uh, those two in there, and I guess those two as well. But um, found a uh, another flaring tool so I had to spend another hundred bucks to get another flaring tool so now I have two flares but um, <clears throat> got it all finished up and as you saw it is all in place and um, yeah looking good happy with the results got the plane turned on its side just makes it a little bit easier but um, yeah that last long one man that was a that was a long fuel line. Got the fuel tank in there. And just looking through the bottom. The only one I need to tighten up is that one right there. I have to go buy a, uh, a wrench to reach that. But other than that, happy with the results. Got the extra tubes done. We'll be able to install these until we get the engine kit which will have the uh, the fuel pump assembly in it because I don't have any of the fuel um, fuel filters and whatnot and the actual pump so all that'll come later so that'll just be sitting there on hold and I didn't have to order any more tubing how about that looking good see y'all soon all right now starting on the rudder pedals um, getting the brakes uh, installed brake pedals and rudders and um, yeah as you'll see here uh, I'll talk to this in a little bit, but they have you start on the right side, um, getting everything installed, making sure everything is, you know, perpendicular to uh, the surface. So you have nice, straight, even brake pedals and um, getting those drilled and then installed. And then you do, once you finish the right side, then they have you start on the left side. And I uh, ran to quite a few issues with this. So it's been causing me a lot of headache over the last week. Actually, had a lot of work done last week, but this video has been on hold just due to trying to figure out what's going on with these rubber pedals. So, yeah, I'll talk to that in a little bit, but let me know what you guys think. Good morning, guys. What's up? It's uh, Thursday morning. Uh, I haven't worked on the plane in a while. I You saw last week I started working on the rudders, um, the rudder pedals, but... Ran into an issue, and I believe, I don't know if it's me or if it's due to the plans, but there um, is either something that I'm definitely missing or an error with the plans. Uh, I emailed Vans uh, stating that there was an error in the plans, but I don't know. The more and more I look at this thing, I just can't seem to figure it out. Uh, basically, what's going on is here in the plans, um, for the very, on the, on the, 
the right side, but it's actually the left side, the pilot side, uh, because these are upside down and backwards. Um, they have you install the WD-1211 left on the inside and the right on the outside. And then that's repeated down here. You can see WD-1211 left on the inside, and then you put the, the actual uh, brake pedal on. But then on the very next page, um, where you actually drill, it's reversed. The right is on the inside and the left is on the outside. So it contradicts itself there. Uh, so I actually installed it like this, uh, went through the procedures and followed all the way down and then commenced drilling and didn't notice that it changed on this page. So needless to say, after I drilled everything on the, the right side in this configuration, um, nothing's lining up. It's all uh, upside down because if you have the left one on the on the inside and the right one on the outside, it actually reverses your brake cylinders. They're on the other side, on the back side of the uh, of the main control arm here, versus on the front side, which is what's shown here. So I don't know. Leave a comment. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Um, someone told me to be careful and watch this page, so I made sure I followed the plans exactly as it is. Like I said, I sent Vans an email on, um, on Monday, but, I mean, not on Monday, on Sunday, and it's today's Thursday. I still haven't heard back from them, but, yeah, can't get these two to line up. Um, I took the, uh, the parts off for the, uh, the, the right side, the left side, and, uh, yeah, I just can't figure this one out, so... Let me know uh, if you guys have any thoughts, suggestions. Like I said, I still can't figure out whether I'm doing something wrong or if the plans are actually wrong, but leave a comment below. Let me know. See y'all soon.